So how were you involved with Alpheo? Well, I was directly involved because I was employed in the work. Oh, employed doing what exactly? Um, labor work. What does that mean? We will fill the buckets with sand, gravel what, and water, whatever they may need to mix the concrete and all that and spread out the shingle on the road and all that. Whatever is here to be done, we'll take part in it. And did that have an impact on you and your family? Did yes, you... because it helped financially. Yes, um, Compared to before, during that peak, what, what, what problems you had before that this helped to solve? Well, um, problems. Yeah, um, so, well, I mean, some financial difficulties, and of course, um, we were able to send out our children to go back to school and things. And apart from that, the road, we were having some problems with the road because the road it was very bad. And some because they have to go to school for more than water and something like that. Um, every time we try to fill it, fill it up with some other substance, it always, the water always come back and bring it back to the farm state, because it's like a state. Right. And so it was all supposed to go out on the end of the Right. Right, and sometimes children have to carry all the French shoes to go up on the road and go down. Yes, I'm back And So it was cost in your work. Yeah. So you know, one of the things, we have three people involved. We have UNOX, we have the Mexican government, and we have the government, the Ministry of Labor, right? So um, in terms of UNOX, you get a little more now, you see where they had. You, get a bit. you knew about UNOX before they came here? No. Yeah? So what do you know about them now? Right. I didn't even know that, so we get to know them. Yeah. I so, wish you didn't know them long time. <laughs> right. So, so UNAPS is one of actually about 24 UN agencies operating in Jamaica. 12 or so of them are resident, meaning that they have an office. Like I work with the UNDP and UN. 